The internet. The cultural revolution of the past century. A major breakthrough in the realm of human communication. A thriving world within our own world. An excellent outlet for people to voice their opinions on important social issues. Like the VMA Awards featuring Miley Cyrus. She's been driven by demons. Pray for her. She's a slave to what she's doing and she is not aware of it. What? LMFAO. He's saying she's a whore. Maybe you didn't understand my what was meant in an unbelievable, are you seriously that stupid manner. And she is not a whore just because she is acting sexy. Look up how the Hollywood stars give their soul to the devil. We need to know what the Bible says about this devil. He is real and he will deceive as many as possible if we are not careful. I'm a Christian and I happen to care. I don't think that this beautiful girl is a whore. God created There's her. There's no such thing as God, little boy. Earth. Did you parents teach you to believe in some random man in the sky who invented everything out of dust? Nah, I'd rather learn about magical explosion that managed to create human life and make birds evolve from a stegosaurus. Bob Jimmy, how do you think this world came into existence? God spoke everything into existence. Yourself a Bible and read. The Bible will even tell you who is inhabiting the other planets. God came down to this earth 2,000 years ago and died on the cross of Calvary on our behalf, so we have eternal life. What profit a man if he gains the whole world and lose his soul? Matthew 16, 26. It's kind of ridiculous how some dude made us. As I ask myself, how the heck was God made? Hmm? If we were made, I need a full-on explanation as how God was made. For now on, I believe Science! So, how come science can't explain where the materials for the Big Bang came from? You know, if the Big Bang Theory created everything... How was God created, hmm? Was he just there and had an idea? I should make a planet! Add moon, stars, trees, vegetation life! There's no way he was just there! Let me ask you something. Have you ever invented something? Or do you know someone who has invented anything? Let's say, for example, the person who invented the airplane is the creator of that airplane, right? So God tells us in his word that he created everything. Because obviously, no humans can create the skies, the moon, the sun, or everything that us humans cannot create. Just think about that for a moment. What the f*** are you talking about? <laughs> Isn't it swell to see people exercise their right to free speech? You know, Nowadays, people have access to large amounts of information, let's say through social media websites like YouTube, or Facebook, or even Twitter. Well, people haven't had that much information since, well, the Great Library of Alexandria. It is amazing how individuals across the globe can speak their minds on such controversial topics like Disney's hit song, Let It Go. Insightful commentators are free to say things like for f**k's sake, who would let a 10 year old out into the snow? A bad mother. Also, she thinks she is f**king Beyonce singing a f**king stupid song. The queen would be a better singer, and who would put in a f**king talking snowman we must contact Notch? Better yet, they could do this without fear of persecution or death. Now that's progress. With this technology, we may be able to reach a point in human history where tolerance triumphs, and we'll be able to solve our problems diplomatically. Or we can be reduced to a bunch of animalistic children who bicker over stupid shit and waste their lives in front of a screen. So, in conclusion, wait, hold on one second. 